Good evening, my dear friends. Welcome to Pathways of Hope. My name is Abiong, and I would like to offer to you the reflections for today's gospel reading. Our reading for today is taken from John chapter 21, verses 15 to 19. This is the reinstatement of Peter. Jesus asked three times as if he was giving Peter three chances to atone for his three denials. This is a wonderful reinstatement. This is a beautiful restoration. Because as you can see here, brothers and sisters, it is the one who is being offended reaching out to the offender, giving the offender another chance. And what Jesus is doing here gives us a glimpse of what's really in his heart, what's in the heart of God. That it is God who takes the initiative always it is god who chooses us first it is god who loves us first the second thing i'd like to focus on is the word love the first couple of times that jesus asked this question peter do you love me he uses the greek word agape it is the kind of love that god has for us it is like the highest kind of love but each time peter answers when he says lord you know that i love you he uses another Greek word, and that's filio, that's friendship love. Jesus asks Peter, Peter, do you love me? Agape. Peter says, Lord, I can only love you. Filio, friendship love. But it's, it's very interesting because the third time Jesus asked, he uses the word filio. It was as if he's telling Peter, Okay, if that's the only thing you can give me, if that's the only kind of love you can give me, I'll take that. I'll accept that. Jesus goes down to the level of Peter and accepts whatever Peter can give. In the same way, Jesus also does that to us. He accepts whatever we can give to him. But this reinstatement and this restoration back to relationship also calls for mission. Each time Peter answers, Yes, Lord, I love you, Jesus would say, Feed my lamb, tend my sheep. Jesus asks us to express our love by caring for others, by leading others. Brothers and sisters, as we continue to reflect on this gospel, let us be grateful for the kind of love that God has for us. Let us be grateful that He accepts whatever we can give. But let's also respond and show our love to God by caring for others. God bless us all.